Right behind me is the greatest fast food burger joint in the country. Well, that is according to Reddit user Cloudy878. And for the next seven days, the only meal I can put into my body will have to come from In-N-Out. Now, if you live under a rock or on the East Coast, In-N-Out is a fast food restaurant predominantly known for their delicious burgers and milkshakes. But the thing is, In-N-Out can only be found in these states. And lucky for me, I live in this state. Now, before we eat, we have to set some ground rules first. Rule number one, I can only eat meals from In-N-Out. However, snacks are excluded. Yes. Rule number two, I have to weigh myself before I take my first bite and after my last bite. And lucky for me, I weighed myself earlier today. The moment of truth. 42. I'm getting fat. And last but not least, rule number three. So to spice it up, every day I have to get at least one item from the secret menu. Also, drop a prediction in the comments on what day you think I will get sick of In-N-Out. But for you guys, I'm risking my health and well-being doing this challenge. Please sub. Can I get a double double with just cheese and spread? It's July 3rd and 4.28 p.m. This is my first meal of the day. Yeah, I know what you're saying. Oh, it's already 4 p.m. and you're barely eating your first meal. I don't eat that often. You dirty girl. <laughs> bon appetit. Oh my God. Now I know this may seem easy at first, but I assure you later in this video, it will get very difficult. Well, I actually don't know yet, but I'm assuming so. All, all done. Sorry. All done. Here's the aftermath of meal one. Not much left to eat. Meal one completed. <laughs> Appreciate it, bro. Well, that's right. I just completed meal number one of the challenge, but we still have many more tough meals ahead of us. Also, shout out the random guy I met inside of in and out you mad cool. Appreciate it, bro. Yeah, I got you. I'm in the gym now. As you can tell, I'm not the cleanest eater. Eater. But I'm here with my gym partner. Yo, what's good? My name's Henry. Henry. So Henry doesn't know this, but for the next seven days, I only can eat in and out Bro, wait, for real? So what do you think about the gains? How do you think the gains are going to be for me? Dude, I mean, it's good protein, but that's freaking disgusting. My stomach hurts right that's now so really gross. bad. I'm going to work out now. I got to burn these burgers off somehow. Oh! As I was filming this video, simultaneously I was also making a separate video testing one star hotels and my friend that I was with asked me this. Should we go to Waffle House? What'd you say? Should we go to Waffle House? So another thing that Primo doesn't know is that I'm doing a seven week challenge of only eating In-N-Out. Yeah, so like, I can't really eat Waffle House. I only have to eat In-N-Out. I'm down to go to In-N-Out too. Well, I just hope so, because I would just be eating alone. I wonder how many meals it actually takes for them to even notice that I've been here every day. Meal number two. And it's a date. And for the secret menu item today, I got, what are these called again? Animal fries. Animal fries. These actually look so good. The cheese looks weird. It's been a long day of testing one star hotels. This is going straight to Yelp. I try to dig in. That cheese ain't cheese. Bro, what am I eating right now? And just like that, meal number two is completed. Good morning. Wakey, wakey. So today is 4th of July, and what better way to spend it than at In-N-Out? The grill, at home, would probably be better. But it's In-N-Out. The last clip you saw was five hours ago, and I am starving. I need to get food in me. So let's go inside and celebrate the 4th of July. <laughs> Earlier today, I researched how long you can eat fast food until you, you know, die and i didn't find a definite answer but what i did figure out is that eating fast food very often increases your blood sugar blood pressure and also produces digestive problems so i'm gonna have a rough couple days but anyways meal three doesn't look yummy i just shot my phone in public i'm so embarrassed but seriously i really don't want to get a heart attack oh. i also hope i'm not foreshadowing anything Meal four. I'm dying inside. I'm walking backwards so you can see the sign, but it's the 4th of July and uh, I got to get a burger because I don't feel like coming back later tonight. I want to watch fireworks. And now I'm walking forward, but with the food. Oh, oh my! <laughs> nah, that was bad. Good old America. Now last night we had a lot of fun since it was the 4th of July, but I messed up y'all. Yesterday, I completely forgot to get an item off the secret menu. As you see, I just had two regular cheeseburgers, both meals. So to make back up for it, I have to get the three by three. Sorry, the three by three. This looks so good. And to make up for it, for dinner tonight, I have to eat a four by four. Es hora de comer. And the last bite, I can't believe it, but meal five has been completed halfway through. Now I guess I'll see you tonight. 
And look at this. I already got the burger right here. Can you believe this burger was $9? $9? It's like the price of a meal, but it's also the size of my head. Now it's the size of my head. I'm curious though. I want to see how many bites it's going to take for me to finish this. Put your parlay in right now. I've never eaten a 4x4, but I'm thinking 14.5 is a line. You either got under or over. Drop it right now and don't cheat. If I'm not mistaken, that was like 13 or 14 bites. I know, I know, clown on me is a bad line. It's a bad line, I get it. I'm sorry, all right, I'm sorry. But anyways, that means we are officially halfway done. So let's get a round of applause for that. Oh, no more sound effects, okay. My stomach is already feeling a little iffy, but that could just be because I'm only eating in and out every day, but yeah. Also, look at this parking spot I got. Oh yeah, look at that thing. Honestly, I was feeling really good the first couple days, but I don't know, I think today I pushed it a little too far with the 3x3 and the 4x4, but it's the things that I do, man. Things that I do. So after last night, I texted my friends about what happened, and a couple of them decided to make a video, and this one says open on day four. Keep much on them burgers, <laughs> <laughs> Bro, what was that ending? But honestly, that video gave me enough motivation, and I felt like I should keep going. So I say we go on to meal nine. Let's do it. <laughs> Correction, meal seven. I don't know why I said meal nine. I just had a double double here. I already took a couple bites and I don't know if I want to finish this whole thing. The only thing keeping me going is that video I just watched. Well, meal seven is completed and I feel even worse than I did before. For anyone that's wondering about my safety, this is my first snack I'm having and it's on day four. This looks amazing. This feels like one of those videos where like those colorblind people see for the first time. And we didn't pay for it, so we should probably get out of here. Well, this is a different scene for me. For the first time in this challenge, I'm actually going to the drive-thru. I'm really tired right now. It's really late at night. And honestly, I just want to get some food and go to bed. But before this, I actually started editing this video and it's actually coming out pretty good. Y'all are watching a great video. Speaking of which, you guys should subscribe and like it. But anyway, let's get this food. All right, thank you, you too. Thank you. No, thank you, in and out But why did I get two bags, though? What's the reason? I made it home. As you see, I got my delicious food here. For the first time, these animal fries are actually pretty good. Definitely an upgrade from the last ones. But I'm gonna put on a nice YouTube video, preferably Mizuti, and enjoy this delicious meal. Let's get to it. Well, that got demolished. Day four completed. Day five. I'm still dying inside. Every video I've seen, it seems like they have a gun pointed to their head. Well, I do feel a little motivated. All right, let's go inside and eat. What is going on in this place? Well, it happened. To answer my question a couple days ago, it takes five days for the workers to realize that I'm eating in and out for seven days straight. How's it been going, bro? What day are you on? This is good. This is day five. You want to say hi to the video? It just like... <laughs> so for today's secret menu item, I had to get a Scooby snack. You said you got the Scooby snack, right? I don't want to eat this. I got hungry. So the Scooby Snack is a secret menu item that's meant for dogs. That's why I ate it. This stinks so bad. What is that? We had our double-double. I also got hungry again. And of course, an ice cold glass of water. Let us feast. So as you guys know, two days ago, I threw up. Honestly, since that, I'm starting to feel really good. So today, we're going to be throwing up inside of In-N-Out. Kidding. But I really needed that. And I also might need to after this Scooby Snack. You want to see some magic? Oh. Magic. I'm not eating the Scooby Snack though. That's going in the trash. It's getting easier every day. No, it's not. I'm at the gym again. It's really empty today. How nice. Oh, and here's Henry. Hi, I'm Henry. Honestly, if I wasn't going to the gym, I'd be on Ozempic right now. Or am I doing both? Let's work out now. That was hard. I don't know if it's just me, but I'm starting to see like my face getting puffier. That's a bad sign. But I am surprised that my face hasn't broken out yet. That's a great sign. Meal 10. Can I just get a double double with just cheese and spread? Maybe one day I can end up like them too. Oh shit, I have to go for it. Thank you. Thank you. No, thank you. All right, I gotta stop doing that. I got the food. Ooh wee. And look at them pickles. Yeah, I know this is gonna be done in a second. Literally a second. You got it, man. I'm on it. Day six. I'm doing better. So last night I looked up something called Gorilla Style. Basically, it's just a regular cheeseburger, but with animal style fries inside of it. Today, we're going to go inside and see if that's a real thing. You guys have something called Gorilla Style? No, I don't believe 
Oh, uh, never mind. It was fake. And even though gorilla style isn't a real thing, we're gonna be making it today. We gently place these fries on this bun. Oh my god. Oh. Yo, this actually looks good. Gorilla style. Now this might actually be where I die. But let's take a bite. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Very gorilla -y. Now I know some of you are wondering why I'm eating outside. And that's because imagine me, me, in and in and out while building a gorilla style french fry burger. That couldn't be me. Well, that's awkward. I had to come inside because my phone overheated and it got really hot. But I'm halfway done with my burger. And this might be the best one I've had all week. Mm. All done now. I really wish gorilla style was a real thing. That was fire. We're nearing day seven. Just got two, three more meals to go. I'm proud of myself. I should get out of here. Well, guys, this is it. The final dinner. We definitely have came a long way. Hey, if y'all learned anything from this video, all I gotta say is take that risk, man. Take that risk. Go do it. What was that? Oh, thank you, you too. I also really hope y'all have been joining this video. Now let's go take this food home. I should put the camera up and enjoy this meal. All right, y'all, so this is the last meal of the challenge. I'm so done with this challenge. We've gone seven days strong. So let's go inside and get our last burger. I like to give thanks to in and out my mom. No, I'm just kidding, bro. You know, funny enough, this burger actually sucks right now. This might be the worst I've had, and it's the last one. This is what it all comes down to, the last couple bites. Two more bites. Every single day, from day one, to day two, to day three, day four, to day five, I didn't know the rest. All to this right here, the last bite. What the fuck? Don't work, man. You can't get it up. Hey, yeah. And if you guys are wondering how much I weighed after, here you go. I weight. 145 pounds. Am I fat? That's it, finally. The meals have been completed. Seven days is done. That's it, seven days done like that. Comment what restaurant you want next for me to eat at for seven days straight. And that's pretty much it. I'll see you guys later. Please sub.